first you was nobody didn't know you but Wait. she was so hot oh, it takes too long to have a cold party nobody couldn't tell us nothing we were so rowdy about it in it get it we got it it was no problem baby we were it's really not even weak what a guess you be so thotty did it all behind my back and now you know yeah wow now you know about it used to love your whole frame and your whole body now you out there with somebody that i know probably started down in your dm like you yo got it i don't wish nobody to end with nobody but you forever back see you got no shoddy i know all your old dirty like a old college roommate try and play me now you try and polish you late My nigga got a band for your band. Uh -huh. And a band for my band. What else? A couple bands for them bands. So it's whatever. When you talk, nigga, what's up? Sick shit. He gon' turn into a bitch if I leave. Might just pull a strap on me. Say I'm where he wanna be, so he spend his last on me. Niggas on my page got him stressed. So he gon' make it happen, it don't matter. The Cheating. Is it the Sixers point guard in love with you? Who, Bryce? Yes. Kinda. And? <laughs> and you should give me your phone. No, absolutely not. They play the Lakers this week. <laughs> oh, you're toxic. Okay. Very Listen, petty. I'm just saying that we could be courtside. Sounds like a big fuck you to your ex. Yeah, I guess. Or what about Chase? <laughs> His best friend? Absolutely not. I am not a homie hopper. Look, I'm just trying to forget about the guy and move on. Fine, come to poker with me. <laughs> just one more game. No, one after the last one? <laughs> no. N-O. Uh, Never again. <laughs> That's fair. Let's go. I look good. Girl, you look good. I am gonna get a man tonight. That is right. Girl, please, like, this is the one. This is the one. Oh my, girl, you are a wife. Like, I cannot believe, girl, you just look too fucking good. Okay, so what do you do for fun? You got any hobbies? <sighs> Not really, but I do love anime. Really, me too. No way, really? What's your favorite? <laughs> well, my brother started watching, so I just kind of got into it. Uh, Death Note. Cowboy Bebop? 
Attack on Titan. Initial D. Akira? Demon Slayer? <laughs> Dragon Ball Z! <laughs> no way. <laughs> Listen, what are you doing tomorrow? You should come over, we can watch some. I have a 4K projector, I'll load her in food, and we don't even have to leave my bed. Okay, maybe. Wait, wait you, you do want to see me again, right? Um... Cheers. Cheers. Hmm. That smile, it's so beautiful. Oh, thank you. And that sure is dope. Black Market Flea, Pulp Fiction. <laughs> Pulp Fiction? I don't know that one. Oh. <laughs> but your t-shirt is cool. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh my God, this guy doesn't know what Pulp Fiction is. So where are you from? Jersey. Okay. How about you? Philly, East Coast. Mm. Ugh, Jersey. But he's kind of cute. One second. Got to get my engagement up, you know? <laughs> you get it, right? Sorry. One more second, one more second. What's wrong with that? Oh, nothing. <laughs> Something is stuck. So, how's photography going? It's pretty good. I had a couple shoots last week. What about you? What do you do? I'm a designer. Oh. We should collaborate on something. Okay. Maybe let me style you, come back to my spot, and see how you look in my collection. <laughs> I see where you're going. <laughs> <laughs> I tell you, I have not eaten all day. I'm about to fuck this shit up. Mm. This taco is so fucking good. I'm telling you right now. Have you? Did you try yours? Yeah. Mm. I'm not gonna lie. Like you look fucking beautiful. Thanks. You're welcome. You, you're just so different than I imagined. That's a good thing, right? Yeah. <laughs> well, you know. I like to keep them guessing. <laughs> so, where are you from? Oh, Beverly Hills. Yeah. Oh, Beverly Hills. Yeah. Okay. Nice so, you said you were from where again? I'm from Philly. Okay, Philadelphia, born and raised on the playground, is where I spent most of my days. <laughs> yeah, that's all right. Is that your real hair? Yeah, it's my real hair. Can, can I feel I'm gonna feel it, I'm just gonna. No, please don't touch me. Damn, shit, all right, well. Shit's up. Uh, can I have the check, please? It's gonna be on her tap. Mm-hmm. Oh, you are fucking nice. <laughs> <laughs> Yo! Another margarita? Yeah, last night was wild. I didn't get home till 4 a.m. <laughs> Leo, he loves me. We go way back. Wait, that. Leonardo DiCaprio? Like, yeah, and Johnny Depp. We're so proud of Leo. No She's way. amazing. It's great. Uh, oh, you know. So I do you work out? Because yeah, I, I need I a woman that keeps it together. You know? Got to be able to cook too. After I leave the club 3 a.m., I'm kind of hungry, and it's just uh. Oh. Uh, Excuse me. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Can I? Can I say something? You actually look good. <laughs> hmm. We're gonna have fun. Mm-hmm. 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 You feel this tension? Yeah. It's great. It's great. Mm. Mm. Ah. Ah. Mm. Run it up. 
Hey, yeah, yeah. Run it up, run it up, run it up, run it up, run it up. Running my cardio good. She don't be doing too much when we link. She just love when I talk on my audio. Dope spot. This is crazy. Thank you. Yeah, I just moved in. So you got a lot of camera gear too. You're a you're a photographer. Yeah, it's my passion. Okay, how long you been doing that for? Uh, about three years now. My bad. It's, <laughs> no, it seems it's okay. it seems like I don't know what I'm doing. It seems so expensive. It, yeah, that one costs a pretty penny. Oh yeah, I may need some lessons. Um, but yeah, let me let me try and take your picture. Oh, sure. Let me see. What's this say? This is film too. Like, let me look at a picture over here. Oh, okay. Sit right there. Okay. <laughs> Oh, wait, hold the hold the bag up. Oh. Let me see how this looks. Eh, hold on. Damn. I might take your job. Oh, will you now? I'm just messing. I'm just messing with you. What? <laughs> Sorry, I mean to laugh. Um, it's uh, it's nothing personal. I just. I'm kind of a germaphobe, if you wouldn't mind, maybe just freshening up just a little bit. It's hard to explain. Listen, like it's kind of like PTSD. I, like, I apologize if you just wouldn't mind freshening, oh. freshening up. Yeah, It's hard to sure. explain. PTSD, what? what does that even have to do with being a germaphobe? Why am I the only one in the shower? Oh, this guy really thinks he's gonna get it. No way. Say I'm a triple, honey, welcome to Trivago. Tell me who you know, who is he tripping for a follow? Who all in the air like Showtime and the Apollo? Popping up your chest, the next thing you know is hollow, but well, hello. Oh. What's up? Hey. Hey, yourself. This is nice. <laughs> Thank you. Thank Where are we you. headed? I can't tell you that just yet. Okay. How do people see you like a bird in the May? 22 years on a personal brand, oh. This is my favorite spot in the city. You know, the ride here is great, but the view just doesn't get old. It really doesn't. Mm -hmm. How long have you lived in LA? Well, I don't really live in LA, you know, I kind of jump here and there, travel a bit. What does that mean? I mean, like short term rentals. You know, spend one month by the beach, three months by the city. It just kind of depends on what I'm feeling in the moment. Okay. So yeah. how does that work when it comes to relationships, though? Uh, I mean, relationships are kind of an iffy thing for me. I don't really believe in commitment. And it's not that I don't think that people can. It's just, I kind of just like to live free. You know, I want to touch things, feel things, see things, be where I want to be. And I just feel like a relationship can tie you down what like that. What am I doing here? I don't even know what I want. I don't even know what I want. I don't know, you know, it's like, sometimes it's just, you gotta find who you are. Hmm, okay, so tell me your most embarrassing dating story. My most embarrassing dating story? Mm hmm Okay, um, one time I'm at this restaurant and I ordered this like big giant fish plate. Okay. And so I'm eating it. And then I go to the restroom. No. I'm there for 30 minutes. <laughs> no. I come back out and the girl is gone. No way. I That's swear. not a real story. I <laughs> well, I swear to God, dude. I call her. Hey, where you at? No answer. Nothing. Never heard from the girl again. Oh, like that. Got a free well, meal. I can see why. Uh -huh. <laughs> uh, you tell me your most embarrassing story, though. Okay. I was hooking up with this guy once and my ex is banging at the door. I literally had to shove him under <laughs> the sofa. It was so embarrassing. Ooh. <laughs> yeah, you had to be there. <laughs> I'm sure glad I wasn't. <laughs> okay, let me ask you, what excites you about someone? 
Hmm. I like a guy who knows what they want, knows who they are. Uh, what about you? Do you believe in the one? I would like to believe in the one. Okay. But I just feel like people tend to be not the one. Hmm. So let me ask you, why are you single? Ugh, I've been trying to get out there, you know? I've been trying out the apps. And people the apps. are just weird. I don't know. What do you mean by that? I just feel like everyone's got something going on with them, like some midlife crisis, mm. and they just project their stuff onto me. Because you're perfect, uh, right? No. Uh -huh. I feel like everybody's got their quirks, right? Yeah, quirks are good. It's just the baggage, a little too much. Ugh, and my ex. She's bringing up the ex now. Oh, sorry. Nice, <laughs> nice. Hmm. Yeah, I feel like everybody's got the red flags but maybe we need to find people whose red flags play without is the best. Okay, I like that. And it sounds like there's a lot of bad dates, and so maybe there's one common denominator. Hey, uh, okay, now you're starting to sound like my therapist. <laughs> you gonna eat that? Well, I'm a grown boy, I gotta, I gotta eat. No, I like your jacket too. Okay, who gave you that? You did, yeah, no? he was a little, you know, taller than you. I don't know if you're gonna fit this one. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. We're we're eye to eye. Like that? Yeah. Disturbing the peace with some peace of mind. Sleeping in jeans, I'ma need a night. O D on a cheap advice. O C on the cheapest flight. Lately I've been on the move, trying to get to something. But I told her I've been running just to see the sights, see the lights, and they're not my types. So we chill with the brother if it's ice all white, but it's not. Am I living life in a box? Tell if it's a crisis or not. I hate coming off too normal, but I can use a wife and a dog and a job and a white fence off where the white kids walk. Well, have I been long? Don't know where the days went. I spent a lot of nights in the no, park. I better spend a few too that. many trying to make it. No. And I, I haven't yet. We had to bet. I'm only here. You know. But if you don't like this music, then don't be listening to it. You know, I'm just a dude that you know, or something similar. If you don't keep it real, can you go somewhere but here? Cause you know. Uh, bro, what are you doing? Uh, I'm making breakfast. That's probably kind of weird. Um, I like breakfast. Do you like breakfast? Yes, I know. Okay. All right, cool. You just throw a grape in my head? <laughs> yeah, do it again. Love it, love it. Ah, oh, that was good. I know. All right, here, open your mouth. I got this one. You ready? Okay. <laughs> got that big old forehead. Hey! Love it when you wake up. All natural, no makeup. My smile making you fake blush. You know where that could take us. Uh. Love it when you slide next to me and say, how was your day, love? Girl, why you gotta say stuff? God gave you that great touch. Uh, I'm loving the hair wrap that you're rocking, girl. Regal when you walking, girl. No one can tell you nothing, girl. Not just head, but across the world. Just head but across the world and you 
told me that you hate it when they come up to you and try to touch it. Or maybe they ask you a question like how you get that around your head. You just kind of smile and say it's as easy as counting down to ten. But in your mind, you're thinking, man, oh man. I really like this guy. I could see this being a whole thing. Is it too soon, though? He probably doesn't even feel the same way. Here I go, getting my hopes up again. 